What's happening everyone? My name is Phil with Precision LED and today we're talking about LED headlights versus HID headlights. Now there's a couple things right off the bat that you need to remember. LEDs are the same if not brighter now than HIDs. They are easier to install and they have nearly the same installation method as an HID kit just with less steps. Now let's talk about some of the key differences in the technology themselves. LEDs are surface mounted diodes. They are essentially an on off switch, very compact system. An HID system is a xenon gas bulb with an electrode that ignites the gas to create light. Right off the bat, you can tell there's a big difference in how many components are needed to activate or to use these kits. An HID system has a wiring harness with the grommet, your wires connecting to your ballast for power conversion and capacitors, and a CAN bus system to make sure that there are no issues with the electrical system of the vehicle. An LED system has a power driver, the connector, and the LED bulb itself. And really that's about it. When it comes to installation, typically with HIDs, you have to account for, in most cases, a dust cover, drill a three quarter inch hole for this grommet to make sure that dust doesn't get through the dust cover hole that you've made, and enclose the system with the ballast on the outside of the headlight housing mounted somewhere in the engine bay. And that was kind of the complicated part about HIDs that people had to go through to do a conversion for better lighting. But now with LEDs, the components are small enough and any system with a dust cover, you can insert the bulb as well as the driver inside the headlight housing enclosure and then close the dust cover without having to worry about drilling holes or getting wires external for placement of some external components. It's a lot easier. Now again, they are the same in terms of their overall brightness as well as their ability to illuminate in both reflective housings as well as these types of spherical lenses. Another key factor is the temperature. LEDs operate at a colder temperature than HIDs. Now obviously halogen is the most temperature intense lighting method, around 500 degrees Fahrenheit. HIDs hit around the 200 to 250 mark, depending on the type of wattage system you get, 35 watt or 55 watt. And these LED systems hover around the 140 to 120 Fahrenheit temperature rating. They're much cooler while providing an equal if not better brightness for your visibility on the road. In terms of their uniformity and beam pattern, when it comes to say something like this, a spherical lens lighting system, the LEDs perform just as well in terms of light output as well as beam cutoff. All of these improvements with the LED system means that you're going to also have an increase in the quality and longevity of the lighting system. HIDs are kind of known to burn out within a year or two just because there are so many components, there's a lot of heat, and there's a lot of power that has to go into igniting this xenon capsule. The LED system, being more simple and direct, has a much better lifespan with an effective brightness that lasts throughout the lifetime of the bulb. If you have questions, you should let us know. You can email us at help at precisionled.com or you can give us a call from our website. Again, my name is Phil. Thanks for watching.